Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. On 29th December 2023, the Defense Secretary Sri Girdar Armani inaugurated a new design and test facility at Aero Engine Research and Development Center that is AERDC of HAL in Bengaluru, Karnataka. The AERDC is currently involved in the design and development of several new engines including two strategic engines which are Hindustan turbofan engine HTFE of 25 kN thrust for powering the trainer aircrafts, UAVs, twin engine small fighter aircraft or regional jets. And the second engine is Hindustan turbo shaft engine that is HTSE of 1200 kN thrust for powering light and medium weight helicopters ranging from 3.5 to 6.5 tons. The new state of art facility which is spanning across 10,000 square meter houses special machines, advanced setups leveraging on computational tools, in-house fabrication and facility and two test beds for testing HTFE 25 and one test bed each for testing HTSE 1200 and the upcoming joint venture engine for the IMRH. The development of HTFE 25 turbofan engine is equally important as that of 110 kN class or higher thrust class engine which will power the future fighter jets of India. This engine of 25 kN class is designed to power aircrafts with lower thrust requirements such as basic or advanced military trainers on small business jets, stealth UAVs and wingmen. The single engine can power a 5 ton weight class of aircraft and in twin engine configuration it can power 9 ton weight class of aircraft. The full engine technology demonstrator for HTFE has been built and the first run of this technical demonstrator has also been completed successfully. The further development of flight worthy engine for certification would require at least 5 years or more. As per the latest update from HAL, the firm is planning to get certification of this engine by the year 2029-30. HL has also planned the afterburner variant of this engine which would be capable of generating thrust up to 40 kN. However, this would again depend on the success of 25 kN core engine. The next engine regarding which we are going to talk about is HTSE 1200 or Hindustan Turbo Shaft Engine 1200 which is a turbo shaft engine again under development by HL. The 1200 kW turbo shaft engine would be used to power helicopters of 3 to 6 ton category such as LUH, ALH and LCH. As of now, one technology demonstrator of HTSE 1200 engine has been built and is presently undergoing testing. The trials and certification of this engine is planned by the year 2025 which is not very far. The next engine regarding which we are going to talk about is for the IMRH helicopters which is going to be developed by a joint venture of HL and the French engine maker Safran. Both the firms have already signed a work share agreement for joint development during Aero India 2023 followed by a memorandum of understanding signed on 8th July 2023. Safran and HL will have a 50-50 work share. HL will be involved in design development and production of some of the core engine components which is a breakthrough achievement in terms of expertise and know-how within the country. Talking about the IPR that is intellectual property rights of the engine, it will remain within the country that is in India. As per the Hindustan Times report of 24th September 2023, HL will commence the work on joint design and development of helicopter engines with Safran from November 2023. The production of engines is expected to begin in four years, that is by 2027. HL is planning to base the Safran HL joint venture 
at the new Tumkur facility, which is the largest helicopter manufacturing facility in India. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.